Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Allah Allah family Welcome to the channel you beautiful people I hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful day In today's video guys we'll be reacting to a video titled Turkey to mass uh, produce its most advanced and main marine uh, vessel This video was suggested by you never uh, know Tashakur Termak I say thank you very much for taking the time to send me your recommendation and suggestion The video is by e-military and the link is in the description in case you guys wanted to check it out So Without further ado guys, now let's get started with our video. Wow. Turkish armed unmanned marine vessel, the first platform of the LX series developed in cooperation with Turkish defense industry companies, is ready to launch missiles. Wow, 50 units. A guided missile, fired from the ELAC armed unmanned marine vehicle, successfully hit its target in the firing test at Turkey's Antalya region. Wow. Nice. The successful test will mark the new era for the ELAC. Turkey is planning to mass production at unmanned vessel. That's crazy. Wow, Turkey's changing the game. <laughs> As reported by Defense World, Turkey to produce 50 units of ULAC armed unmanned marine vessel a year. Wow. Turkey plans to produce 50 units of its armed unmanned marine vessel, developed by Ares Shipyard in cooperation with Medexan Defense Industry Incorporated under the ULAC program. Interesting. That's crazy because I think this is one of the few if not the only unmanned vessel so all Turkish engineers are really really advanced and they're really advanced now with their drones Duku Alonso, as well as CEO of Ares Shipyard, uh, was uh, autonomous to vessel media. today that simulation firing has been successfully carried out and that real missile firing with warheads will occur in the coming days the Turkish unmanned marine vessel, or known as Sida in the country, has a cruising range of 400 kilometers or 249 miles, and a wow. maximum speed of 65 kilometers per hour. Wow, that's fast. It is equipped with an indigenous encrypted communications and day and night vision capabilities. Nice. Besides attack, it can serve in intelligence gathering missions. Wow. That's cool. And it has a big range, like over 200 kilometers. It's crazy. The vessel is equipped with a long-range anti-tank missile, anti -tank. manufactured by Turkish wow. rocket maker Rakhazan. In addition to supplying the Turkish security forces, Alon said that the exports would start in line with permits given by the Ministry of National Defense. Wow. That's awesome. In an interview with Anadolu Agency, he said that his company has the capability to produce over 50 SIDA a year wow. and make them ready for operation. 50 a year is still a game changer. Well, uh, Turkey has really advanced uh, technology and I think one of the reasons that uh, Azerbaijan had uh, won the war against uh, Armenia was because of uh, Turkish uh, drones that they were uh, using and now subhanAllah so they've got uh, unmanned uh, vessels which uh, at least this is the first that I've ever uh, seen I haven't heard other country actually having like unmanned vessels I've heard of like unmanned tanks which I don't think they have actually started using it in the battlefield 
but uh, this is the first unmanned uh, vessel that I hear so it's just cool and it makes me happy to see that it's coming out of uh, Turkey and inshallah more success uh, to uh, Turkey so thank you very much guys for suggesting this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did then please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and as always if you like uh, to suggest a video you can include that in the comment section below and thank you very much guys for all your love and support i hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day take care of yourself and your family inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care and wassalam